Ladies and gentlemen, now the presentation of the award ceremony. Moses Opening day, the regular season is set to begin, and we're thrilled to bring you all the live action right here on 2K Sports. Kevin Harlan here, and I'm joined by Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg with David Aldridge on our sideline. And now the Lakers starting group. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Russell Westbrook out there with Patrick Beverly, and it's Walker in at the three slot. And for the Warriors. The core of this team all out there. Curry and Thompson in the backcourt with Green at the four. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Kevon Looney. Ah, the unmistakable feel of the first day Clark of the NBA regular season. A game each of these teams and us as broadcasters have been waiting for for a long time. No doubt about it, Kevin. And the excitement you feel as a broadcaster, but even more so as a player, is something you have to temper down, especially if you're on the court. I mean, you don't want to have your adrenaline and excitement affect your focus. So you focus on the work that's gone into getting ready for the season, and then you try to just let that work lead how you play. And he hits it and gets hacked on the play. A three-point possibility if he can convert the free throw. And no wonder Green has been called a heartbeat of his team. He just makes plays that energize the entire First, roster and as good as Draymond First, Green has been foul. on the floor this guy will be an all-time broadcaster dogs. already a Draymond popular podcast Green. great TV Green. studio appearances Green. as well find the lane find the lane one shot free throw good Green and Draymond Green, the next broadcasting star. You've watched his work. Why is that? And Kevin, I think his basketball IQ is incredible. And we see that when he plays, but he can also vocalize it to the audience. And of course, Draymond is not afraid to say what he thinks. Yep, it counts. Once AD gets the ball inside, he's about there. And a little power takes care of the rest. And it's Curry with the ball, bringing it up for the Golden State Warriors. Thompson passes to Curry. Looney kicks to Wiggins. Golden State moving the ball around. Curry outside. Connects from three-point range. 
Anytime Curry gets a look from deep, he's letting it fly. He's probably knocking it down, too. LeBron passes to Walker. Outside Westbrook. Back to Walker. Pass to Davis. Shots good by Walker. Walker before. Yeah, going hard to the rack, making a statement here early on. Yeah, that's how he rolls. I mean, intimidate the opponent right now. Now here's Curry, and it's out of bounds. Last touch by Curry. Here's LeBron. Getting the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Well, I talked with head coach Steve Kerr. The issue that concerns them the most about the team they're facing tonight is matching up with that quickness. He said, at times, we may go with a smaller and quicker lineup ourselves. Other times, we have to use our physicality. It really depends on the flow of the game. Guys, we'll see how this one turns out. Thanks, David. Here's Westbrook following the basket by Stephen Curry. Davis kicks to Beverly. Let's go. Here's James. Oh, and he plucks it off the glass. Wow. Knocks it loose. Stolen by Westbrook. All going up court. And finished off by Davis. Well, Davis, a game-wrecking presence around the basket. Excellent agility for a big guy. Higgins outside. Curry passes to Wiggins. Thompson for the triple. Headshot off. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. James looking around. And they'll get another chance. Two free throws. Coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Definitely saved the layup with that foul, and he'll make him earn them from the line, and that's what you want to see. Lakers shooting their first free throws here tonight. First one drops. Ray, here's a classic NBA question. Who's been the best franchise in league history? The Celtics or the Lakers? Come on, Kevin. You are putting me on the spot. But uh, I'd go with the Lakers. More superstars over the years. And I think that 2000s run with Kobe and company, that put them ahead in my estimation. He's as solid as it gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. Curry way outside, and the Warriors get it back. A shot by Thompson, and no one's around. No good on the three. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. From deep, Walker. Offensive rebound. The Warriors have gone 3 of 7 from the field since we've gotten underway. Thompson outside. Pass to Green. Higgins outside. Down to five on the shot clock. And again, it's the Warriors missing. And so James will bring it up for the Lakers. Walker finds Westbrook. Shoots over Curry. And Westbrook gets Westbrook. it to go. Westbrook. Defense all over Westbrook there, but he's crafty. He's slick, and he was focused on that shot. Thompson outside. Looney with it. Davis is there. Lays it up and banks it in. I like the play call. Very solid. Making perfect use of the pick to get a great look. James against Wiggins. 
right side Davis over Looney and Davis can't get it to go Warriors have gone four for nine from the field to start this game off. and the basket by Curry Andrew Wiggins, the former first overall pick, showing off his passing skills there. Outside Westbrook. This is it to Walker. Davis with it. Looney on him. Davis kicks to Westbrook. Shoots over Curry. And it's Westbrook missing. You know, the fact is, he's not a lock from there, but he was open enough to where he should have hit that shot. Missed in Zion. Boy, that's a look. He has to finish, and he knows it. Blown opportunity. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. And really, whatever your take on Russell Westbrook is now, you can't deny his place in NBA history. Voted as one of the NBA's top 75 players of all time. free throw drops for Russell Westbrook. Greg, it is impossible to argue against Westbrook belonging to that top 75 players list, isn't it? It, it really is, Kevin. I mean, his career numbers and accomplishments speak for themselves. A very unique player, easily one of the best during his prime. And Russell Westbrook drops them both. Hey, you can't diminish Westbrook's triple doubles, but just as important to me are the intangibles. His passion, his tenacity, his competitive spirit and drive. I mean, that infects the whole team in a positive way. Yeah, just solid work on the back end of that play. Yep, you're right. Finish hard with two hands on that stuff. Yeah, highly efficient. Nothing extra special there. Just effective. Now, here's LeBron. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Wiggins with the block. Great read that time by Wiggins, anticipating the shot. Sends it out with return to sender postage. The drive by James. And LeBron throws it down hard. LeBron showing you how he does it. A stylish flush by King James. Wiggins surveying the floor. Got a piece of it. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that one. And here's Beverly. Wiggins with the block. And they get it back. Anthony it's Davis. good. Golden State's gone 1 of 5 from downtown in the first quarter. Points out there have been hard to come by. Thompson misses. Los Angeles has gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Westbrook passes to Davis. Over to the wing. To the middle. Here's James. That falls. Nice feed that time, out, time out. from Walker. LeBron's got his Not second bucket. Here. You know, LeBron in the paint, I think, is major trouble for just about every defender. He can power his way to the basket, or he can pass you into being dizzy. And the Warriors decide to take their first time out here. They're trying to stem the tide here. Yeah, you know, they had to do something, anything to stop this run. You can't just let it go on any longer.
look here for the Warriors. Green, he's checked in for Green. Jonathan Kaminga comes in for Wiggins. Dante DiVincenzo, he's checked in for Clay Thompson. And Poole subbed in for Curry. Now here's Kaminga. Looney kicks to DiVincenzo. And he uses the glass on the way. You know, in the pick and roll, you got a lot of options, but sometimes the best option is to do it yourself. DiVincenzo making the right choice there. Pool against none. Now the pass to Reeves. From downtown. Oh, he touched it while it was in the That's cylinder. Interference. Offensive basket interference. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. An emphatic rejection that was. Boy, you've got to appreciate that kind of forceful in-your-face defense. Here's Kaminga. Pass to Looney. Now Poole. Pass to DiVincenzo. Takes the 13-footer. Rebounded by the Lakers. Toscano passes to Reeves. Here's Toscano. None with it. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Gabriel, the pass to Jones. And Jones with the stuff. Oh, you got to love his aggressiveness to finish inside. Well, his leaping ability gives him a great advantage. Fellas, that's exactly why they look to get him the ball around the rim. I mean, it's either a dunk or free throws every time. And here's DiVincenzo from the arc. That shot is no good. And he's one for three from the floor. Here's none. And it's Looney with the rebound. Warriors trail by four. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Here's Poole. And Jones pulls it down. And so it's none with it. He brings it up for Los Angeles. Here's Toscano. And the first shot of the night for him, no good. Down low. Here's Poole. And he dunks it down. Love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent pass. Los Angeles is going over three from three point land. Nothing yet going outside. Nunn passes to Reeves. Back to Nunn. Here's Reeves, defended by DiVincenzo. In the corner, Nunn with it. It's good from long range. And the Lakers lead by five. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. And there's a lot you can say about Golden State's offensive abilities, but their defense is also razor sharp. They, they know how to control the flow of the game. Two minutes now, three. here's DiVincenzo. Two they kick it out to Green. Clock at four. No good there. And the Lakers going the other way now. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Yeah, I like the way they're setting the tone. Really playing with a lot of energy here at the start. Gabriel, one up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. And some might go as far, Greg, as saying Golden State's defense is underrated. It is kind of overlooked at times. And their shooting is so exceptional. It hides in deep three else, but how they can dominate the glass. Defensive, Defensive foul. Kendrick. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for Los Angeles. And they've set the tone from the jump. They're looking to pound it inside and score in the paint. And, you know, another thing that's been working for them tonight, scoring off turnovers, points off miscues. They've been converting any mistakes at the other end. That's good from Poole. And this Lakers squad has a ton of talent. But some guys are well past their prime. None passes to Toscano. Back to none. Lakers working the ball around now. From 13, here's Jones. Up and in on the layup. Jones. Jones has got his second basket. 
and, and loving the hustle here early. I mean, they struck first on the offensive glass. And those put-back baskets contributing to their lead. Now, here's Kaminga. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Poole finds Wiseman. To the inside, here's Green. Count the bucket, coming off a perfectly placed assist. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Here's none. Warriors with the rebound. And that one gives them a plus five rebound advantage, Kevin. Pretty clear they're dominating that area. They've come out with a lot more energy and effort so far. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Now, here's none. to the wing right side it's stolen by Green and still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close Lakers ahead they lead by a bucket and we'll be back in just a moment with the start of the second quarter as we get back to the game that's been pretty close here so far. And what stands out to you from the Lakers in this one? Well, one way to generate more offense, pound the offensive glass. That was the difference in the first. Oh, there's no doubt about it, guys. Without those second chance points, this game would have had a much different feel to it. So the Lakers five right now. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Patrick Beverly out there with Russell Westbrook. And it's Walker in at the three, the small four. Watch out now. When this guy gets into a rhythm, it is something to behold. Westbrook dishes to Beverly. Inside, it's stolen by Wiseman. Thompson passes to Kaminga. That's in, coming off the assist from Thompson. And the Warriors lead by three. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets have been exactly of that variety. And yes, it's good. And that's now six points for Russell Westbrook. Love the preparation that time by Westbrook. He was ready to shoot it before he caught it. Wiggins finds Curry. Here's Weitzman. Goes back up. Whistle blows. Basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. Yeah, coach's pet peeve there. No box out. Those are free points you're giving away. You gotta work harder on the glass. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Green, he's checked in for Jonathan Kaminga. At the line for the Dubs. James Weitzman. One shot. Free throw good from Wiseman. And you see players trying to get the officials to blow the whistle. Were players in your day great falling down as much as they seem to be doing now? Oh, it's way more common now. And, and let's face it, it's a copycat lead. All the whistles slow the game down. I, I just love to see them let a little bit more go. Now here's Thompson. Here's Curry. Gets it to drop, and now he's shooting at a 5 for 8 clip. And at the offensive end, he's done about as much as they could have hoped for today. LeBron passes to Davis. Good, and the assist goes to James. James has got three assists now in this one. And I tell you what, AD is able to brush off those defenders with ease because of how strong he is. That's what they call weight room. He's certainly starting to heat up from outside. That's his third for the game. His second in this quarter. 
LeBron against Wiggins. Trying to get open is Davis. Great D that time from Green. Warriors leading by seven. Kicks it to Curry. Some nice passing by Golden State. Count the basket. Green's got five points so far. And now you see them starting to really work the ball inside. So the Lakers call timeout their first. Curry with a strong contribution so far in this one. You know, that defense is helpless right now. I mean, he's got their number, and he knows it. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. Green against Walker. Davis the pass to Westbrook. Good. Nice job down low. Eight points for Russell Westbrook. Just by nature of his style, Westbrook is going to draw contact. So he's got to be strong enough and focused enough to play through it. And he is and does. Now, here's Curry. 15 points in the game. Here's Wiggins. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Give them credit. Offensively, they've been the more efficient team. Well, you know, it's been all high percentage shot for them so far. I mean, just the kind of execution you want in the, in the first half. The dubs, Andrew Wiggins at the line for one. GA with their fourth title, the combination of Steph, Clay, and Draymond Green, the single most successful trio in the last half century in the NBA. And, and some would argue the best trio of all time. The most wins in the finals ever by a trio each made in James all NBA teams. Well, what a great effort that time by Davis. Just never gave up on it. Worked through tough defense and still found a way to get it up and down. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stands for the Warriors. They're contesting shots and, and have also come up with some significant blocks, putting a little doubt into the minds of the opposing shooters. But how about their scoring in transition as well? That's been a big factor to this point. Are those high tops or track shoes these guys are wearing? My goodness. One of my favorite eras in NBA history, Clark, the 80s Showtime Lakers. Man, I played against those guys. Thankfully, it was just twice a year that we were in the Eastern Conference. Those dudes were unbelievable. Magic running the point. Kareem still playing at a high level down low. Worthy finding his stride and finishing the break. They didn't just win titles. Showtime had a flavor that was fun to watch if you weren't being run out of the building by him. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Alden. David. Thanks, Kevin. Of course, the Warriors' offense stands out for its emphasis on ball movement. Coach Steve Kerr says, if you get to touch the ball and be a part of the action, whether it's as an assist man, ball mover, shooter, dribbler, the more people who are involved in the offense, the more powerful it becomes. Kevin, strength in numbers indeed. As has always been the case for his offense, the more the better. And it's worked for him. DA, thanks. Here's Curry following the basket by LeBron James. Pass to Green. Thompson surveying the floor. Curry outside. And another three for Golden State. You know, he started the game knocking down shots, guys. Now in the second quarter, he's taking it to another level. High post, Davis. And there's the pass to Westbrook. Shoots over Curry. It's rebounded by Curry. And it's Curry with the ball, bringing it up for the Golden State Warriors. To the paint. Here's Green. To the middle. Over Walker. That one off the back iron and out. Lakers trail by eight. Here's James. 
and he drops in the layup off the glass. LeBron's got four points in the quarter. They're consistently finding ways to get the ball inside and taking full advantage. Pretty clear as smash mouth basketball. Pound that thing inside. Now oh, here's Wiggins. Some nice passing by Golden State. It's Curry outside. No good. And the Lakers going the other way now. And here's Walker. Right side Davis. Over Green. And it's Davis missing. Warriors leading by six. And a deep three from Curry. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Davis has got rebound number seven for him tonight. Westbrook kicks to Walker. LeBron James on the wing. He's covered by Wiseman for three. No good from LeBron. Golden State's gone three of five beyond the arc since the start of the second quarter. Pass to Thompson. From about 19 feet. And that's good. Four two. Thompson's got six. You know, he started slow, but now in the second quarter, he's finding his groove. Walker taking his time here. And Davis now top of the key. Over Wiseman. Again, the miss by the Lakers. Dishes it to Kirk. Back to Wiseman. And finished off by Weisman. We know Curry has tremendous vision, and he uses it to tee up his teammates for easy shots. Walker the pass to LeBron. From past the arc. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. No doubt it's been a bit of a struggle for him here in this quarter in terms of scoring. And he gets the bucket. And now it's a 12-point Warrior lead. A much better quarter for them shooting the ball. Anytime your field goal percentage is in the high 50s, partner, you're doing something right. And he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. Hard to believe, Greg, last season, LeBron missing the playoffs for just the third time in his career. And Kevin, it, it almost felt surreal to not have him in the playoffs. I mean, this guy's been a fixture in the postseason for almost two decades now. Just another bullet on LeBron's incredible resume. And he makes the first. Hey, there are guys who have played as long as LeBron, okay? But how many have maintained their physical abilities the way he has so late in his career I think that's a short list. And the Warriors with a completely new five on the floor. And James drills them both. They've scored really well this quarter. Keep it up, and they'll find themselves right back in it. Here's Poole. Finds the open look, and it's on target. Poole's got nine. Unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flame. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming, attack mode. He doesn't know how to That's step great. off the gas pedal. And play stops, whistle on what looks to be an illegal score. And not the most common call you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue that pick wasn't illegal. Yeah, you know, the officials aren't nearly as lenient as they used to be on that call. As a matter of fact, I know I got away with a lot of those in my playing days, but that was 40 years ago. And the Lakers making a change here. Gabriel's checked in. Boy, have they got hot here in the second quarter. No wonder they're in front. Now, I don't know if this field goal percentage is sustainable, but if they can stay close to what they've done in shooting the ball, they'll, they'll run away with this one. Los Angeles calls timeout. has got the ball here for the Lakers. Down by 15. 
Reeves the pass to Jones. Here's Reeves. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. He's now one for two with that bucket. I like the play call. Very solid. Making perfect use of the pick to get a great look. Poole the pass to Kaminga. Up top, DiVincenzo. And here's Poole for three. Gabriel with the rebound. Lakers trail by 13. Here's Toscano. Here's Reeves. That three off target had some space there after the little pump fake. Pass to DiVincenzo. Now Poole defended by none. Here's Kaminga. His second shot goes in. Off to a good start. Two for two. When you allow good scores to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. You know, he should be getting extra attention from the defense, not less. Now, here's none. It's good. None's got five points so far. And that's what the pump fake's there for. Get your man off his feet and drive right around him. DiVincenzo finds Green. And Jones sends it back. Passes it to Toscano. And the ball out of play. The Warriors will inbound. Warriors basketball. One fifty-three left here in the second. Poole the pass to Looney. Green deciding where to go with it. Down low. Here's Kaminga. Count it. Kaminga's got six here in this quarter. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. None bounce pass. Here's Jones. It's good. Jones has got his third bucket of the night. And you're not going to pass up that kind of. There's the pass to DiVincenzo. Kuminga with it. He feeds it to Green. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Wow, wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. Blatant contact. Straightforward call. Simple. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. And I know he was pleased with his foul shooting last year. How about 87% from the line? And guys, the numbers don't lie. I mean, he was such a reliable presence at the free throw line too. all throughout last season. The first one falls. Both free throws good from Green. As we've gotten closer to halftime, their style has become more and more physical. Boy, it certainly appears to be the case. I mean, they've spent a lot of time at the foul line this quarter, and that's the result of attacking the rim and being physical. Here's Reeves. Pass to Toscano. Five on the clock. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Jonathan Kaminga picks one up. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. For Los Angeles. One, Toscano Anderson at the line for two. First free throw is good. <laughs> 
And so he makes both from the line. Warriors leading by 13. 34 seconds left now here on the second. Even Chenzo passes to Kaminga. Off target from outside. And so it's none with it. He brings it up for Los Angeles. Pass to Reeves. Jones looking for an opening beyond the arc. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Looney's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Puts up a three. No good that time. It's been all about Stephen Curry for the Golden State Warriors. He comes away with 11 points in the quarter and is showing no signs of fatigue. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. 15. Thanks very much, Steve. A good rhythm for you in the first half. What do you like most about how your team's competing? Just like the ball movement, you know, the drive and kick. Our guys have played really well together. Uh, we're trying to move the ball, get a great shot. We'll see if you can keep the ball flying around as we continue. Thanks. Back to you guys. All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Boy, a lot of energy in this arena tonight. The, the hometown fans getting after it. I'm Ernie Johnson. Shaquille O'Neal's here. So is Kenny the Jet Smith. The first half was all about Stephen Curry. He had 18 points, two assists, and one rebound. He's been a different player than he was in their last outing when he was off his game. He's rounded back into form tonight. Hey, big fella, what's your take on Golden State so far? They've come out determined to push the pace. I'm getting the offense, getting the ball court as quickly as possible. The advantage in transition points has been the major difference in this game. And over to Kenny, your takeaway on the Lakers. Ice cold, frigid from beyond the off. The question is now, can they shake it off and get back in the groove? Another option is compensate by going to the rim. And that's all we have for now. Tell the folks goodbye, Shaq. Tell the folks goodbye, goodbye. Kenny. Goodbye. Let's go to Kevin Harlan.